G'day, welcome back to Purple Shark Action. I know it's been a little while since we posted a video. I've been down south having a bit of time away, a bit of a holiday break, but we're back. So let's get those rods in the water and catch some big sharks. Ew. And see this right here? This is essential for this kind of environment. Well, Spuddy what is, sand flies everywhere, what is, man. What is it? Got some bushman here. A bushman. Buddy mosquito repellent. Sand flies. Get rid of them. <laughs> Tonight we're running with the big dirty ray. No doubt we'll catch some sharks in this guy. Fairly quick too, I assume. Big dog shark. Yeah, big dog shark, hammery, bull shark, a lot. For those who are new to shark fishing and uh, want a bait of a stingray, because stingray is good bait, but it's a little bit tricky too at the same time. So what you want to do is you want to cut them in half, depending on the size, and then cut them across into quarters. So then they're good, perfect bite sizes for the sharks. You don't have to worry about them chewing too much. You're going to set the hook straight away. So now that you've cut them into quarters, you can see they're perfect bite sizes for a shark. You want to put your hook somewhere where it can't double back in itself. So what I mean by that is you're going to put it here. Once it's in the water and it's, it's um, defrosted a lot more, this hook's going to want to move around. And what it can do is it can go simply like that and double back in the bait. So then the hook, uh, the hook point is sitting in the bait, so it's going to be heaps hard to set the hook for the shark. So what I find is what you want to do is, I'll do this one here. You want to find a good little soft spot about here somewhere. Cut a little insertion, just in the skin. The stingray uh, skin is very tough. Just like that. <clears throat> Actually, I might make that a bit bigger. And you want to get in there. You want to slide the hook under the skin. Right. So, it's tough. There we go. Like so. So you don't want the actual hook to sit into the meat, you just want to sit it underneath the skin. And now, if I do that there, the hook uh, the hook point can't double back in itself at all. So it's going to be sitting there the whole time like that. Sharp bites it, instant hook up straight away. So, we'll clark that out now. So that settles it. Well, let's go back in. That's one bait, time for number two. So right now I've got a shark on. Right, people say. Oh, sure, I'll leave that one. Second one's going off. I oh, know, it's crossing line though. Yeah, that's what it is. The chat's gonna swoop in here in a second. Yeah, yeah, I'll see him. Go behind you, right? Get a bit Watch my back, man. Dead weight, eh? Yeah, different shark on there. Yeah, that's so a different shark, man. Different shark. I'll hurry up. Sorry for the car. We ran out of storage on the phone, so we had to delete some old videos. But now we're back in business. But look at this little tiger pup. Bloody gorgeous. It may also have another shark, another second rod. Don't know yet. Alright. Want to release them quick? Beautiful markings on this little tiger. Let's get it back in the water. Yeah. You go that way. Where are you going to go? Yeah, that's the way. Yeah, there you go. That's the way. Quick, quick, quick. Yeah, go. Should I follow him out and see if we can go? Off he goes. 
So we just got that little tiger shark on the 80 watt, so I'm just gonna clock another bait out right now. Yup, you got some hook. Come on, man. Oh, what is that? Hey, bad money jumping. Hey, look at that. I guess not so much now, but Yeah, it's not really going now, but. Until he knows that you've hooked on him, then he'll be gone. Yeah, I'm going up. Yeah, yeah. It's in the jump, eh? Yeah. I think it's just going to hook on you. Yeah. <laughs> going straight towards you. Yeah, you can't let that happen, man. Oh, he's got one. Oh. He hit the line. Oh, no. No, he didn't. He had it. Huh? There's another shark on Oh, shit. Yeah, it's double wet me, boy. Woo! Get him off of that lawn, man. Hey, look at him. Look at the shark, Nick. He'll yeah. jump on the other shark. Yep. I oh, have a look at my swans on that reel. Yep. Getting a dance with Flash. Yep. Pull my quick. Oh, man. Close, close. There, there, there. Quick. Throw in the ball, Shark. Oh, look at the gun. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Nice little female bull shark here. You see, it's got some little um, sea lice on it. So we just had a massive scream on the 80 wide, but it dropped the bait. So hopefully it comes back. So in the meantime, we'll get this bull shark back in the water where it belongs. Bulls. Yep. Bro, we ain't missed the bull shark. You gotta go that way, dude. Oh, he's getting caught in the line. He's all good. Nice little shark, that one. I might lift my line up. Under you go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, straight on my line. Oh, there you go. No, it's moving towards the right. Cool. So we just caught and released that little bull shark. At the same time, we had a double hitter. The 80 wide started screaming. Uh, we tried to set the hook. We uh, failed. But the bait's still on there. We can feel the weight, so it's still sitting there. Hopefully that shark comes back. Right now, I've just rigged up another bait on the 130, so I'm about to kike that out. Hopefully get some more runs. Thank mm -hmm. you.